Hello everybody, I am Brayman19 and welcome to episode 7 of our Papal State campaign in European Universe House 4. So I think I've decided what I'm going to do. I'm going to cozy up to France and Castile, and then I'm going to move away from Austria. Um, they're great and all, but they're not that great. So, And besides, if I'm going to go this direction and then go east, and then maybe eventually take on Poland and all that, I'll need strong allies who aren't going to keep getting eaten up or fighting over this land through here. So I think uh, that's what I'm going to do. All right, let's uh, so let's start trying to do it. First thing I got to do is relationships, improve relations with France. Everybody will, everybody really would probably rather be our friend. So uh, there's this. Go boop like that there. Regimental camp. Do that. There you go. Yeah, it looks like. Uh, Castile's trying to get a little bit of this Granada territory. The attacker against Granada. Um, let's go ahead and do this Justified Wars. That drops that aggressive expansion impact by 10%. Point six nine. I wish I could afford another one, but I can't. But my Pope Alexander the Sixth is a one three one, with a strict trait oh one one zero one Blah. we'll go ahead and have him drill Let us see. Um, Bony in order. Can't placate. Not really worried about their opinion. Or about that liberty desire. If they decide to you know, go for it. Which I think the only thing keeping them back from doing that is just, uh, yellow. Yeah, well, they're trying to build up. Let's see here. Um, allied to a rival. They'll take away 25 when I get done with that. They do have a claim on my land. Aggressive expansion. So that go, that'll go away very shortly. Hmm. Let's do that. How far will this go? Improve by 60 and go up by 40 total. So we need to try to get that full 40 more, uh, that full amount. Then I can leave the HRE here. Which might hurt the HRE enough. That he stops being able to progress. Some Protestantism up here. Hopefully I can keep these guys Catholic as well. I'd rather have them friendly. Oh, there's a Regency. Do this. Um, production efficiency. Yeah.
trying to catch up. Okay. Um, Venice announced this as a rival. Dissolve that alliance. Hmm. Okay, remove that. Yep, we have decided to leave the HRE. To improve relations the last little bit until that counts. Yes, we've lost those effects. Too few rivals. I'm going to pick... Can't pick Venice, can I? Dang. Um, Aragon's not a bad pick. You know, I could start trying to cross over here, maybe take some Tun uh, Tunisian or Tlemcen land. I mean, I gotta get something. Hmm, lose 20, lose 10. Gain 10, gain 15. But I'll lose 25 ducats, which I don't have. How long will it take me to get that? Two months. Yeah, two months from right now. Invest in ideas, of course. Dang, I'm so close. Can declare war there. Wouldn't have any friends help. Especially with that Bohemia problem. Yeah, I'm behind here. Come on. Maybe I could do something with my naval strength. Well, I can't afford any ships right now, but how much? I could get eight. Like a galley fleet of eight would be nice. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to get it, guys. We just need to kind of wait it out. I mean, we're four away right now. Love to war it out with somebody right now.
They have too many diplomatic relations as well. They I wish they'd get rid of Savoy and Provence. I mean, those that would work. I can go to war with Provence. That would be great. That would work. Or Ferrara. That would give me Provence. Hmm. Yeah, we could, us, the Knights, and the Livonians could not take on Poland, Lithuania, Bohemia, and Aragon. That's just crazy. I don't understand why certain people dislike us compared to, like, say, maybe trying to dislike the Ottomans. I don't understand some of that. Urbanus the seventh. He's a three three one. He's better than anything I've had so far. He's an embezzler. Did that give us any rep? No, actually it made it worse. He's at war with the Ottomans. He's defending against them. I'm going to kind of watch France. If France has a hard time with the Ottomans, then uh, we might could use that to our advantage. Or if they're too busy with them, at least. More manpower. Okay. Fifteen hundred. Yeah, and your fifteen hundred will have those guys to worry about again. Austria wouldn't join, but Poland would. Of course. Of course it would work that way. A diplomacy. I'd rather have the morale of armies, guys. Livonia Notar has declared war. With Muscovy and all them. Great. I'm going to lose the Livonian order now. At least Castile will come help. I mean, that's something. There's the Iberian Wedding, so now Aragon is on our side, too. Didn't go quite the way I wanted it to, but it went better than... It could have been worse, I guess. Don't ask me how, but... I never did get to try to break Naples off. Oh yeah, they're going right up. Yeah, they're going to go after Provence too. Good job. Just going to kind of sit here and see what happens. Nothing good, obviously, will happen, but, I mean, who knows?
Yep, he just has better morale and all, I'm sure. Yep, we lost negative 1.5. Yep, not going to be a good time. Yep, not going to be a very good time. I think I just kind of failed altogether at this mission. <laughs> it's just not... It's not easy, and the fact that you've got a... I mean, if you can't run out there and do what I did, I guess, and just jump and grab everybody. I mean, you kind of have to build up your own core stuff here as well. You see, Provence is starting to really get hurt, though. If I wasn't at war, that still wouldn't work. Okay. There goes alone. Yeah, I'm just going to use these guys, see what happens. Okay, go here. There goes the truces with those guys. Peace offer from Provence. Let's have a chat. War reps. There you go. Provence is going to probably not be a problem in the future. If I get it my way. Are these anybody else going up there? I don't know. Let's do that. There we go. We've caught. Okay, let's see. This guy, yep, they're still helping me, but I don't see what they're doing to help. Unless they're way out here already. Uh, ten devotion, no. Can I maybe get a hand? There you go, Aragon. Come with me. Um, let's say Castile, you're going for that. Aragon, you're going to go for that. Let's see if they'll go. And I'll go up there too. Way over here. Out of the way. According to this, we have a better chance to win though. 
It's definitely not my fault. It's definitely not something I'm doing. Here. Let's see if we can give them a hand. Oh, they're gonna go walk off elsewhere. Alright. Your choice. Oh, they're gonna go from Moscow. Wow, that's very awesome of them. Shoot, they're about to come attack me here. Colonialism has been born. Oh, but you didn't come help me? That wasn't nice. Oh, I'm going to get stacked here. Yep, there goes a nice stack wipe. I just, I'm not, yes, yeah, it's just not very good. Not a very good one. We'll see if these guys can take Moscow and uh, Movosk. If they can take them both, I'm pretty sure they could. We could knock them out. Um, Age of Reformation. Hmm. Switzerland will send us a Swiss Guard. Cool. No, we actually probably need to take it. Come on, Naples, you got it, man. Castile, why aren't you sending larger amounts of troops? You had it going down, man. go make it happen guys oh Poland and Lithuania is now joined I don't know how defender okay whatever not gonna question go get them guys see what we can do I mean just I'm gonna kind of sit around for a second and see just what happens there you go knock out yeah knock it out Yep, they're going to overrun him here, but... Because Moscow, or Muscovy, whatever. Sweden sitting out there like thinking they're going to do something. I'm telling you, it's it's coming down to luck. That's how I'm even winning these some of these wars. Like I'll admit it, I know it's luck.
Hmm, I wonder how he's got 27% just by holding the war goal, maybe. Oh, looks like we're going to go try to take some stuff of Sweden's while with some forces out here. Lose to war exhaustion. There goes Sweden. Let's uh, repay that loan. Okay. It's now 5% in our favor. We're going for Leaflin. What? Poland actually fought him and took things? Or, Lith for, or gave it to Lithuania, whatever. Okay, you're done. You'll be a march. We'll take that. All right. Um, let's do that to Ferrara. Uh, reformed. All right, guys, I'm going to end it right here. I went a little bit longer this one just to make sure that happened. But I'll be honest, I don't know where this is going to go. I'm going to have to kind of sit back and think on it for a while. It's not a really good situation. Um, if I could just do it, I would go ahead, try to get like a, you know, try to get like a Teutonic ore to pop up at like 1601 or so, you know, prior to 1601 from Poland. Uh, and then after that, I would just go after Jerusalem as quickly as I could, build up as big, many forces as I can over here. And uh, honestly, I, I, that'd probably be the best way to do it. I can't think of anything else that would really, really do it other than that. Um, but yeah. All right, guys. Appreciate y'all so, so much for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out the link for Discord in the description below. And I'll see you all next time.